it's the first game, first time you all played a team twice in the season. Is there anything special about that that the coaches have told you? Uh, they really haven't told us anything special about it, though, but since it's our first first time playing a team twice, that we feel like that we should be able to play just like last game because last game we played great against them. Is there any anger of overlooking a team that you already beat pretty handily once this year? No, nah, we, we definitely don't want to do that because we know in playing in the SEC anything can happen. How do you think your game's coming along in uh, playing time to your kids right now? Uh, I feel like my, my game's improving every day in practice, uh, coming in and getting more shots and just doing anything that I needed to get better at. You know, with my playing time, uh, I don't have any problem with it as long as we win it. And uh, I know that other guys that get in the game, they do good. And what, when they're doing good, they're going to get more playing time. So I, I accept my role. What have the coaches told you about why your minutes kind of decreased there? Uh, they really haven't told me why, though, but I probably know why because as Jared, he's been playing really well, and uh, when him, with him playing well, he kind of gets more minutes than me, but I'm fine with it. Mississippi State was the game that you played a lot, and they kept leaving you open, and you passed up a few shots and kind of right. developed some conversation among the fans. If, if, if that happens again Wednesday, you're going to take those shots? Uh, I'm definitely going to take those shots now. Yeah. Uh, then getting in the gym, like I said, more, and I, I have plenty more confidence than I do now. Speaking of confidence, going on the road again, you got more confidence now than you were before. You won at Missouri, and uh, you guys won in the next two games. Uh, next two games, uh, playing on the road, it, it really doesn't bother me or the team as well, because we just feel like it's another game. But but we know that all the fans are kind of against us uh, when we're on road games. Though, but I feel like it kind of make us want to play more harder once that happens. What have you done to help your confidence? Uh, help my confidence. Uh, the coaches have been telling me to shoot the ball, and that's giving me great confidence. Even my teammates, when they pass it to me, they're telling me shoot it from open. And I'm being able to get on the lane and get some few shots in in practice. And when I make shots, it gives me more confidence in myself. I mean, Willie's kind of just the, the protective blanket for us guards, really. Um, obviously, if, if, if the guards let the man go right by him, it's going to be hard for Willie because they're going to go right into him. But like I said to him, we, we just have to kind of cut them off just enough to where Willie can be there and um, block the shot. And you guys saw it last game. He was unbelievable. So hopefully we can keep getting that presence out of him. I, I don't really know. I just know we have the best fans in the world. So, I mean, if that's what they're talking about, then sure. But that, I think that's a good thing more than a bad thing. Do you laugh when you hear stuff like that about being overanalyzed and it becomes such a big topic as you're used to topics around here? <laughs> I, I, yeah, I mean, I guess so. I mean, people will find a story about anything. I don't know. I don't know even who said it or what. But uh, Cal. Oh, Cal said it. Uh, I was just telling him, I don't know if we're overanalyzed, but – I mean, we have the best fan base out of any team, so if you count that as overanalyzed, sure. Does the criticism ever bother you guys? Not, not really. I mean, we try not to pay attention to the, to the bad stuff because that's just that's not good for your mind. Um. Uh, Honestly, not really. I mean, obviously, we know we know a little bit about that team more than we would a team that we haven't played yet. But as far as us goes, we, we go into every game the same way, worrying about us and executing, and that's exactly what we're going to do Saturday. I don't, I don't think so. I think they've already learned that any road game in the SEC is tough. I mean, we've us veterans have told them that it doesn't matter what team you're playing, you're on the road in the SEC, it's going to be a dogfight. So. I think they know that, and we know that, and we're going to be ready for the challenge. How much throughout the season do you all look at the SEC standings? Me? Not, not really at all. I don't even know where we're ranked in the SEC, honestly. But I don't, honestly, I don't think we worry about that. And I think that's good for us because we're – honestly, we just worry about ourselves and us getting better. Is that not a, your all's main goal to win the SEC? I mean, I'm sure it's probably not the main goal, but is, where does that um, rank and what do you want to do this season? I mean, we want to win every game, so – that, I guess that would be a goal in that case, just to win the SEC. But I think we're more worried about us getting better every day than, than looking at the standings or who's in front of us or who's behind us.